You know, actress Gwendolyn Osborne, uh, you may, you know, recognize her from The Price is Right or some other television shows, but she's also in Wonder Woman 1984, among the other things that she's doing. So we want to talk about that right now. So, Gwendolyn, let's talk about Wonder Woman 1984, since that's the, okay. the current thing that we want to talk about. First of all, how did you even get in this movie? I mean, it's a little bit of a Hollywood story. Um, I was uh, at a funeral, and um, mm -hmm. uh, it was a, it's a Wonder Woman of mine that actually passed away during the production of her own show about herself, which was being produced by Patty Jenkins. Um, and uh, it was unfortunate that she passed away in the middle of it, but um, her daughters and I, our best friends, were basically like soul sisters, and so we were doing everything to make sure that this moment was beautiful for her. Patty was there to send her off, you know, and, and say goodbye gracefully. And um, as I was just there doing that, I mean, of course, I knew that Patty Jenkins was going to be there. And this is the director of Wonder Woman. In my mind, I'm like, oh, my God, I've got to thank this lady so much for basically taking a Wonder Woman in my life and, you know, getting her story and, and making it you know, available for everybody to see. I just was, I was in gratitude for that. But the next thing I know, Patty Jenkins is tapping me on the shoulder and asking me to be one of her Amazons in the next Wonder Woman 1984. So it was, it was a lot of emotion in many different ways. Um, and I feel like it was like a, a gift, uh, you know, from, you know, Fauna Hodel uh, for me to continue and believe in myself in life. And, and so I, I went on from there with Patty, and, and it actually was real. Because <laughs> I, mean, I was like, are you serious? Um, yeah, and I just worked really hard with Jenny Pacey, the, um, the trainer that was there. Because uh, you had to work out six and, hours you know, a day, right? Flown to England, and we started filming. Right, right. I'm sorry? Six hours a day is, where, is how much you were working out at the time to get in shape for this movie? Six hours a day wow. for six weeks straight now let me tell you something <laughs> <laughs> i'm not gonna say i was a couch potato before right i've always said you know for modeling world and for you know acting as an actor you gotta you know as a singer you gotta keep your body in a certain type of shape but woo to go from being a mother of three to you know you know only just kind of like staying in pretty good shape to having to get to six hours a day in shape let me tell you i was struggling to walk some days like you know you know when you get that hard workout and you look at a set of stairs because so it was like that to just get out of bed in the morning you know wow that's a lot and you did some yoga as well so you had you had a balance there you hardcore workout and yoga yeah i mean they 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 literally wanted us to have like a good balance of everything so you know shona virtue was brought on as one of the major she's a a major yoga instructor she's done david beckham so she keeps quite a few of the athletes uh international athletes in shape and uh she came in to do our yoga side jenny pacey did all of our hit training and our weight workouts and then we had our stunt training so that's why it took six hours okay all right